Voters in the Lagos Island and Victoria Island metropolis of Lagos State trooped out in mass to their various polling units to cast their ballot. Plus TV News correspondent reports that the exercise was generally peaceful in Lagos Island and Victoria Island amidst reports from other parts of the state where violence characterized the process. Our first port of call is the Kuramu Junior College along Ozumba Umbadiwe Road in Victoria Island. At about 8.30 a.m., voting materials were still being sorted and transported to various polling units by ANEC ad hoc staff for commencement of the exercise. From here, we moved to Faloma Police Barracks. Voting didn't start until 9.27 a.m. in this unit. The wife of one of the major contenders in the presidential race, Senator Oluremi Tinubu, cast her vote here along with others. Our crew also visited the Ayekole polling unit in Lagos Island. The atmosphere was generally peaceful. Voters waited patiently till about 10.15 a.m. when the exercise kicked off. Governor Sawonlu, alongside his wife, Ibijuke Sawonlu, arrived just on time and cast their votes. So, Lagos Island, Ayekole, um, what and um, I mean, it's very peaceful. We came in here, we sat down, and after a couple of meetings, minutes, we were called on for accreditation, and uh, the accreditation I think went very well. Our wife and I, and um, we were given the ballot papers to go into a cubicle, cast our vote. The story wasn't different at other polling units visited. As peaceful as it looks in these units, it wasn't without some hitches. They couldn't capture my fingerprint, but they were able to capture my picture, which is, uh, they said they have those two options. If not, you know, the, the process is fine. But when they started that, and it's just within a minute, I'm done. So I, I think it's, it's all right. It just was chaos. First things first, there was no internet connection for the guys to be able to connect or even find your names on the card reader. A certain card reader was not accepting some names because it was wrongly programmed and they didn't have the right um, first name um, initials on one. We anyway, went through that. Card started working finally. I had to pull out data for all of us and then we now started to go accordingly and then start to make sure that all the menace didn't happen. When I was here since about one hour and a half hours now. But when I came, the first place, at the first place, they say my card is not be read, but I have to exercise patience. So I go and check my number and I tell them about the number so they check the thing they get and it was okay. When I when I tried accreditating in the first they said uh, my name wasn't on the on the beavers, so they told me to come back. So I just did now. I came back and I just did. As at the time of filing this report, voting has ended, collation has begun, and counting of results continues. Nigerians now wait with bated breath to see who among these three major contestants will eventually become Nigeria's next president. Love Ikuku Uyidoku, Plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.